The ternary operator is not unique to Perl, but it's unique being a ternary, having three parts. So there are cases that you would ri write something uh, like this, uh, an if statement with a condition, and then if it's true, then you assign some, va some value to a variable, otherwise you assign some other value to a variable. This is a very long way to write this expression. For this, there is this ternary operator, which has two parts, uh, three parts actually, with two operators, a question mark and a column. And the way it works is that this condition is here, and then the two values, a and b, are in these two places. So if the condition is true, then the a part is executed and assigned to this variable. If the condition is false, then the b part is executed and assigned to this variable. And this can be used, this ternary operator can be used in assignment like this, or you could we could call just print instead of this whole assignment, and then the print will be executed on this if the condition is true, or on this if the condition is false. And uh, the A and B can be any expression, so these, these can be actually several things uh, that you do, or just a number, or just a string, or, or it can be anything basically over there.